I'm Dan Ackerman, and we are here with the HP Pavilion DM4 Special Beats Edition. Uh, what they've done is taken a standard uh, Pavilion 14-inch laptop, dressed it up in this cool matte black exterior, and of course added that Beats Audio subsystem that you're used to from the higher-end HP Envy laptops. What you end up with is something that's $899, but looks like a much more expensive machine. Uh, you know, it's got a standard Core i5 and pretty much everything else you'd expect for a mid-priced, mid-sized laptop. Uh, but frankly, this is one of the coolest examples of that uh, kind of overused genre uh, that we've seen. I especially like the backlit keyboard. I always love backlit keyboards, but this one, because of the Beats kind of color branding, is red. And that does two things for you. A lot of the backlit keyboards that I've seen are just too bright, if you're, especially if you're using them in a dark room. It's just a little bit overpowering. Um, so here, in this case, the red light is almost like the red light in a dark room. It's muted. So even if it's a dark room, let's say you're watching TV or something, you can turn on the laptop and use the backlit keyboard without really blinding yourself, without it being too bright. And plus, it's frankly just a unique look. I don't think I've ever seen a, 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 a colored backlight keyboard like this, except for some Alienware laptops that have very adjustable things where you can change, you know, like four different quadrants on the keyboard to be different colors. And of course, uh, the actual surface material is a matte black. It's got the big Beats logo on the back. Uh, There's a metal overlay on the back panel. The rest of it is plastic. And that brings up one of my uh, few problems with this particular system. It's $899. Uh, it's definitely good for what you get, but for like $150 or $200 more, you can trade up to the HP Envy line, which has everything this guy has, but also an all-metal body and uh, usually a discrete graphics card, which the uh, DM4 Beats edition lacks. Now, that's still a sizable additional investment, but if you're already up to $900, I'd have to seriously consider, uh, you know, adding the 150 or 200, depending on if you want the 14 or 50 inch HP Envy, because those are really the go-to premium, high-end, uh, mid-size Windows laptops right now. I'm Dan Ackerman, and that is the HP Pavilion DM4 Beats Edition.